mopping, wiping, and extra sanitizing, the new norm for restaurants and employees. With the recent spike in coronavirus cases within the southern tier, restaurants are taking extra precautions by deep cleaning to keep customers and guests safe and to slow the spread of the coronavirus. With the real radical spike in active cases that we've seen in our county, uh, we were concerned that it would just be really hard for us to control our environment enough to be very confident that everyone's being as safe as possible. So owners like Knowles have briefly closed the doors, grabbed the soap and water, and got to work. During that other time that we're shut down, we're going to continue to just clean inside, sanitize, mop, wipe down everything. Just two weeks ago, a recent cluster of positive cases from a local church put members of the community on high alert. And Christy Mertzak, owner of Curly's Chicken in Elmira Heights, says it's also putting a damper on an already struggling business. I've heard people saying maybe restaurants should close down again or... Um, you know, maybe the county executive should close businesses down. I don't think that's the best idea. I think as long as everybody's doing their part in protecting themselves and protecting others, that we can still operate, operate as a community. She also says this is a lesson in training all staff members on the importance of slowing the spread and keeping the environment healthy. Make sure we're educating everybody on what our procedures and policies are, what the regulations are. While restaurants are putting in the extra work to keep customers and employees safe, the community still has to do their part to slow the spread of the virus. For AT News, I'm Daryl Matthews.